Okay, so uh, I'm Jerome Petazzini, uh, and I'm going to talk about using kind Kubernetes in Docker for local Kubernetes development. So, uh, kind what it is, and also I'm going to give you a little why I picked that one today. Uh, so, kind stands for Kubernetes in Docker. There is an official SIG for kind, uh, which makes in a kind of an upstream project, like very close to the Kubernetes code, ba code base. Um, and it's leveraging something called kubedm. And that's pretty cool because a lot of other Kubernetes installation methods are also using kubedm. So if at some point, you know, if you decide to go kind of under the hood and tinker with your kind cluster, uh, or if you actually, if you tinker with any cluster that has been installed with kubedm, it's going to work the same way on kind and uh, on these other clusters as well. Um, I'm going to... Um, uh, create uh, a kind cluster. All right, there we go. Uh, okay, so as I was saying, um, we are going to see kind in action. Uh, so kind, uh, installing kind itself, which is just a Go binary. Uh, so I think here I installed it with my distros package manager, uh, but otherwise, um, when you go to the kind project, uh, you're going to see these installation instructions here. And it's basically either you use go get or you just get a binary uh, and, and that's it. Nothing, nothing complicated, nothing fancy. Uh, and of course you need Docker since we are going to create um, Kubernetes clusters in Docker containers. And then uh, we do kind create cluster and that's basically it. Uh, it's going to uh, pull the node image. Uh, that typically will take a little bit longer. Here I, I pulled that image uh, a couple of hours ago uh, to make sure that we wouldn't have to, you know, wait like twiddling, uh, uh, twiddling our thumbs for, for a minute. Um, and then it's going to start everything. There we go. And that's it. Now, if I do kubectl get nodes, uh, I see that I have a kind control plane node. It's not ready yet, but let's give it a few seconds more. And eventually it's going to switch to ready. And Okay, 30 seconds maybe. Told you it would take, yeah, there we go, ready. Told you it would take about a minute. Okay, so now I have a Kubernetes cluster running in local containers. 